These are just a few examples from the stained glass effect corner unit. Now these corner are from unit. corner unit. You make it sound like something you might have got in the seventies. Do you remember corner units? Mm hmm I do. I remember being sat in the corner. Right, this is your stained glass set. Now it just might originally I thought, oh that's a great idea. You could we can do mirror image, there's two demonstrations showing you ideas, but there's hundreds of different ways you could use these. I'm going to show you a few, but I'm sure you'll come up with loads of them. Great Christmas as well, creating snowflakes and all sorts of things. So that's, that's one demonstration showing you how to make that card there. You can see that you get that as well in the set, you get the project set. But that's how to make the corner you have. I move this out of the way. You'll see better. Or maybe you won't. <laughs> I'm going to move all that out of the way so you can see. There you go. That's the corner unit. You, know, you could do four of those and put them in your window. But it's double-sided, you see. And I'll show you how to do that. It's very simple. And because I use very thin paper, when the light goes through it, it does look like stained glass. What do you think? Oh, I think it does. I've, I've been very, very impressed with this set. Because not only can you use them for corners... You can make up little shapes as well. I mean, can I love your that. Hand, I can't see the monitor. I love that crisp. I love that Christmas tree effect you did with them. Yeah, well, you'll have to watch the demo to, to watch see the that. Are you teasing them? I am. I'm Let's show them. you what you're going to get I'm in the set. Them. Now, whatever you see, you're going to get that mirror image as well. So you've got the A4, the big A4 design there. Then you've got the next design set you get in that size. Don't forget these could be corners on projects that you're doing. Use them in a tray. You can use them in lots of different ways. You could create Christmas trees by layering them on top of each other in different sizes. Do all sorts of things. It's, your imagination is the thing that will only hold you back. But if you lack of information... I'll take you forward. All you've got to do is uh, have a look on our website. Well, that's a hint. That was a subtle hint to change the camera angle. Thank you very much, because you don't pick up on subtlety, do you? And by the way, if you think we're a bit close, we're in a bubble. And if you're watching this in a couple of years' time, it won't really matter that we're in a bubble, because hopefully there won't be anything to be in a bubble for. Bless. Yeah. We should do a series about you. What? I've lost my thread now. I don't Barry know what I'm bubble. talking about. Anyway, let's get back to these. That size, you get four to a sheet there on that one. And you've got the little diddy ones. Now these little diddy 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 ones I here. Well, I've not finished down here. Oh, I thought you wanted to go up there. Well, your subtle nuances are not working today, okay. are they? Camera two. Back. And you've got the little ones here. These would be great for corners. So see, you want to do an album and put the pictures in. <laughs> Stick them down. We you shut your clock and so, just concentrate. You're so cheeky. Who? You. I'll get on. You've got background papers as well. You've got this one here. And you've got this one. Next one down. And next one down again. But, back to me. Uh, if you've got an A3 printer, you've also got files in there that allows you to print on an A3. You think, why would I want to do that? Well, you can do things like this. Oh, you're getting good, you. You can do a nice big stained glass window effect like that one. Cut that out. You could do all sorts of things with that. That would look great in your window. So you can go it? large. And the good thing with these as well is because they've done on paper, you finish cheapest paper you can get. Because it's printed in the sunlight, it's only going to last you know, six months maybe. But you can change them at any time. Like a bit of double-sided tape on. Just whip them off, whip them in, whip them off. Sounded a bit wrong, that, didn't it? Interesting. Anyway, you get this size in the A3 and you also get all of the backgrounds in A3 as well which would be great for wrapping up presents or using for different things or a little bit of coupage and a little bit of old rubbishy furniture you've got. And the price is just $1.99. $1.99 and then you're going to get how many sheets for this one? I don't know. I didn't say me. that. No, I didn't. That was for the it's, other thing. It's on the description. Well, you've got what, you've got what I've shown you. Plus, you get all the mirror images as well. Yeah. So, but like I said, just look at the description by the side yeah. of this video, and that will tell you exactly how many there are in the set. But if you want some, if you want some inspiration, make sure you look at the demonstration videos. Absolutely.